All right. Uh, this is Cat Game Sukaban Shacho Reina, the game that sold less than 100 copies uh, in its first week. And I am trying to do a hand cam thing just because I want people to know exactly how badly the game controls. Um, and I figure this is probably the better way to do it. So um, first things first, got to, while looking at my camera, make sure everybody sees safety. Always be safe. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, so we'll be doing a new file. Yup. Um, if it looks a lot better now, that's because I actually managed to get everything running on uh, emulation, as opposed to having it captured through the Wiimote, which was not as good, <clears throat> or through the Wii uh, via capture card, via component and all that. But we will get all these great cutscenes of um, of a cat sleeping on a desk. And I do believe this is us trying to get a job at a cat log. Blog about cats. That'll never work. Yeah. <clears throat> well, it's a blog about cats where the CEO or president or something is a cat. And this is actually the president and or CEO of the company. Um, I don't know a lot about the game because I don't speak Japanese at all. So, yeah. <clears throat> I'll be skipping most of the cutscenes for, for this and probably most of the LP. Because <laughs> I don't <coughs> care much. <clears throat> Someone really wants to translate all this. They can go ham. There's a lot of good gifable moments, though, like that. That thing that just happened. <laughs> oh, also, it's a magazine, I guess, not just a blog. So there's that. One of the biggest problems I'm having with this webcam I'm using right now is that it's like, um, it's kind of low resolution for time, so I can easily just, if I go too fast, it'll just completely lose track and just blur like crazy. The frame looks like really <laughs> terrible on it. <clears throat> so I'm going to have to get another one for the foot pedal in particular when I do foot pedal Donkey Konga bongos and stuff. Because I do, at some point, want to at least give a very extended attempt to the um the bad time the the bad time foot pedal donkey konga bongos run right uh -huh. which is a thing i do want to try but um i don't know i kind of like the motion blur <laughs> it makes it look like you're going really really fast ah uh, yeah it might be okay <laughs> for for this but um when I'm doing the bad time run, it I'll definitely need to be able to, uh, like you know, get it nice and well captured. Because yeah, that's gonna be gonna be tough. I mean, I'm gonna do a couple other things first, but that is on the list of things I want to attempt is to beat every run of Undertale with pedal and Donkey Konga bongos. <laughs> And yeah, there's only like two parts that I'm worried about at all. <laughs> so, I can tell you one reason uh, this game kind of sucks is uh, this. Even if I spoke the language, I would already be like, please, <laughs> please be game. <laughs> I'm guessing it's for cat enthusiasts, but it's really like goofy, so I don't know if it would actually appeal to a cat enthusiast. <laughs> so I feel like my camera's got some really weird zoom thing going on. Let me see if I can figure that. Flip image, use different output format, camera control. Is there like a lot of no the zoom is either 
one or two and neither actually works. And there's pan or tilt, but it is not actually. I'll work on that later. I could also do really bad Chroma King, which is pretty funny. <clears throat> yeah, maybe it was to appeal to visual novel people, but I don't know. I mean, it does kind of have a little bit of, um... Oh, okay, whatever I just did actually, like, made the blur way better. Okay, never mind. Oh. Yeah. Whatever, I guess tear, turning off the low light compensation just fixed that. All right, well, actual game time. Um, so this is the one I'll be using save states to cheat on, is the quiz. Um, and the piano. We're going to see how well piano goes. Last time I did this, I had like a shitload of lag. So we'll see if I can do it when I'm... <laughs> oh. So you don't actually have to swing to any specific, it's just swing at the point of the notes and then swing the nunchuck. Yeah. Problem is the music's like awful. Yeah, I'm listening to it now. I don't know if you know about how precise the sensor on the nunchuck is. Um, here's a hot take. It's it's not. <laughs> yeah, I never had good luck with nunchuck shaking in video games. Um, there was one that was really bad, and it was the first No More Heroes. Had a boss, though lady with the prosthetic leg who would like throw you in a pit with grenades and stuff where um, oh yeah yeah she could easily just throw you in a pit and then like one of your commands would be like Sh shake the nunchuck a whole lot to get out and it would just like <laughs> not work half the time and then you just were screwed that one was bad I don't think I ever heard a piano at all during that song um no, actually, yeah, I think you're right. I don't think there was one. <laughs> it's kind of amazing that you mess up, like, the core concept. Alright, so that's a gold. Good. I think I've got piano good enough that I can do it. Um, so this one is, like, a goddamn nightmare. If I remember right, because they want you to, like, lean left and lean right, but it just... Like, they want you to do, like, this kind of thing, but it just yeah. never works. Also, weird emulation thing going on there. <laughs> I'll have to look at the recording. No, just, just phase your hands into the hell dimension to complete the trial. Yeah, because it's like... Okay, and then you hold A to open your arms and embrace... Okay, so it's kind of like... Also, it's really hard to tell where the cat's actually aiming for most of the time. Hmm. Like, what? Okay, it's been like the same side every time. What? I don't... Hmm. What? Oh. I, is this one just the same every time? Oh, shit. <clears throat> yeah, so it's really hard to tell where the hell the cat's going. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can get severely dunked on by this fucking cat.
Apparently the studio that did this has been in business since 1991. Really? I'm guessing they did not close after this. They're probably just like a shovelware manufacturer. They're, yeah, they're still up, but yeah. None of their games look especially good. Alright, I have saved a state, because this is the save scum portion of the run. Um, because it's a quiz. And apparently it's like a uh. lot of like weird like mannerisms and things and Nice, got him. Um, it's also timed. So it's just a answer cube. Got him. This is the correct way to do this, by the way. Nice. Um, so this is actually how I have to do this. Um, the first one, I think it was the first and the second I managed to brute force. The third one, however, um, not only is it way harder and way stricter, there's also like five minutes of cutscene you have to rewatch if you fail it. Oh god. Yeah. <sighs> So, like, that was hell. That's actually where I had to stop the stream that time. I was like, I, I don't I don't know what to do here. Like, <laughs> just... Fucking... Um, the nice thing, though, is with saves coming, this becomes incredibly easy, because I can ev answer every question perfectly in, right. like, a millisecond. Yeah. Like, I've run through six seconds and answered, like, seven questions or something. Thirteen, actually. Fourteen now, yeah. So, I'm the world's fastest quizzer on Japanese things. Yeah. So I'll probably get it up to 20 because I have a feeling that'll probably be enough oh, to get a uh, a gold. Uh, and I'm, I'm putting me cheating in the LP, by the way. I'm, I'm like not even going to cut any of this kind of stuff. Leave yeah. it all in just to let people know, like, this is why I'm doing this. <laughs> I don't. I, this is how I did it. This is what you would get if you played it at home. I spent like two hours trying to brute force the third puzzle at one point, like off stream, and it just wasn't happening. Hmm. I was like, yeah, this is the worst. Like you had to get This one just seems to be asking like how many times this symbol appears on the cube or what symbol appears on this color, stuff like that. Yeah. I'm not sure exactly what it is, but there's some that are apparently just like, they were questions later on of like, I don't even know how to explain it, but it was just things that were like difficult even for people who like speak Japanese from like learning it. <laughs> but I'm gonna uh, fuck it up pretty hard right here. Just cause that gets our timer to drop a lot faster. I don't know what the exact number you need for this is, but I guess we'll... Uh... showed you before you started. Did it, actually? Okay. That's yeah, the number below is, like, the amount you have to get to clear. Oh, well, I know the clear one. I mean the uh, gold. Oh, I don't know. It doesn't say for gold. Because I want to get... I can't remember if there's a rating higher than gold. If there is pure platinum, I'm going to have to try and do that for the LP. <laughs> Yeah, there's cat rivals, there's cat love interests, there's cat, like, subordinates who are not very good at their cat jobs. Alone in the world with the little cat job. And the first of the many Zandatsu gifts we got out of this game. <laughs> this game is beautifully odd. And it kind of leads me to wonder, like, I know, like, for instance, uh, PS1 had a shitload of shovelware, obviously. Like, that was probably peak shovelware, was PS1. Mm -hmm. Oh! Apparently, I, since I got pure gold, I have unlocked. I, I don't know. <laughs> I do not know what I have unlocked, but it was something. Like, 
Looks like you got like a calendar and a duck to put on a cat head. How do I duck? All right, one uh, sec. I gotta go find the duck. Ugh. If there's more things to LP, if I can show the depth, man, the only other person I know of who's like played any of this game at all and got like a quarter as far as I did was Corn Shack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a second Zondatsu gift we got. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna fuck up Corn Shack. I'm gonna show him his LP is shit. <laughs> Let me show you a good cat game LP, motherfucker. About time somebody took that Corn Shack guy down a peg. Yeah, people are too nice to him. <laughs> Um, so I guess let's, well, I'm going to save state here to make sure it doesn't, like, back me out a whole bunch. How do I? There. Okay. Um, what? Huh? Oh, I think I did, like, a chapter select. I think you might have restarted the game. What do you mean? You went to story mode earlier and then it started to play the intro again. Oh, no, no, no. I mean, I think that was just like a chapter select. Oh, I see. Yeah. I'm going to load my save state afterwards anyway. Oh, and I think this is, yeah, the different levels. So you can go back and do your mini game trials and see who number one is. Let's see, like, I think, like, for instance, on puzzle level one, oh, it wouldn't be on the save file, but <clears throat> I, like, cheesed it out, and it was, like, 5,000 or something. Um, that was the minigame. Story mode, minigames, and then probably settings. Which, in all fairness, the settings does have a couple good things, including... The very slow cat. Okay, so third option was options, and the fourth one is rewards. So I think uh, that might be where you set up your bonuses. Yeah, there's the there's the duck. Nice. Nice. Save that duck. Oh my god, is is the cat just gonna have? duck at all times now oh my god all right this game's way better than i thought all right so um car is the game everyone will want to look forward to um money grabbing is also pretty good so the whole idea of money grabbing is yeah that Y you'll see. Are you familiar with Cat Game at all, by the way, Andy? Did, did you see? Any I've of seen like before? a tiny bit of it, but I haven't seen Money Game. Oh God, Money Game is one of them that like God wouldn't be. It'll stop. Wouldn't be bad, but it's like in. <laughs> it's like insanely hard to control. Is what I'm trying to get at. This is actually like the one and the reason I put the cam up was that one. Man, Japanese salary negotiation is brutal. Mm hmm Like I think I found the best way to do it is to tilt forward and hold A and then wiggle left and right. That seems like the mm. best way to do it. I don't even know if you have to hold it or not. So like you can even do it that way. Nice. Yeah, controlling that is a fucking nightmare. In <laughs> case you were wondering. Um, motion controls are good. Um, they're a good gimmick. I hope people do more. Yeah, see, that was only a silver, so I'll have to... Oh, no, you can't go back yet. Okay, yeah, so I'll have to save state a lot. 
Make sure I get first run. So this is the game where I think everybody went from like, man, this game looks stupid to like, what the fuck is this game? And the answer is good. <laughs> See a speed gauge. I'm interested. Yeah, dude, don't... Huh. Yeah, no, this game's great. <laughs> yeah, I can't fully figure out what I'm supposed... Supposed to... It, oh, I have to... It looks like sucking the stuff up gives you a speed boost. Yeah, that's, that's the idea, I'm pretty sure, is to, like, get that stuff sucked up whenever you can and then um, hold Z to like use your boost yeah so, like, it seems like you have to thing. go a certain amount of distance mm -hmm. yeah and there we are um, the biggest problem is like the turning they want you to do like this or this but it, it doesn't you know Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of just like we motion controls it was not that precise I'm pretty sure they're just it's just like a tilt sensor and yeah I, I don't know and this one's just a shake that's all it can detect I'm fairly certain it's just waggle like that's it I would have to ask Admiral about specifics of what the Wiimote's capabilities are yeah like that was gold though so got that one down here's the worst one um yeah, so they'll demonstrate nicely. We have to dance and do our morning aerobics. Oh no. This is definitely not happening in the motion capturing. Yeah. <laughs> it seems like you're doing okay. Yeah, that's the other thing. It's hard to tell because your score isn't given in to you until you're done. I mean, you're getting a lot of good, so... Yeah. Yeah, this is a, a really good depiction of what we motion controls actually do versus what they claim you are required <laughs> to do. That's kind of, again, another reason I think this game is, like, perfect for this. Also, these parts are so fucking long. Why? Why is it? What? <laughs> <laughs> and like half of the checks are just that you're not moving. Yeah, something tells me they didn't actually bother to go super deep into the motion tracking aside from are you moving? Are you not moving? Like here you see you see this yep arms a kimbo a car arms not a kimbo
Yeah, <laughs> it's just my fucking arms is holding still, just entirely. Okay, so people. Boy, like, what a workout. People do like the Wiimote, um, the the the, the Wiimote cam. I, I was thinking it was a good idea, because this game's Wiimote stuff is programmed so incredibly shit. <laughs> like the only thing that really works ever is like the pointer, because you just say like put thing where point. <laughs> it's really mm -hmm. not hard. Can't imagine why this only sold a hundred copies. Under a hundred, I think, actually. Oh, right, yeah. No, yeah, feel free to dig deeper. It's actually really hard. Like, I uh, had to have... I can't remember if Psych or Ragni help out a little bit because the only information I could really find of, like, decent written caliber was in French. Don't ask me why. Um, but yeah, shockingly, this game didn't do super great um it's mostly famous for selling so badly but i am loving this little duck on top of our head this duck rules <laughs> how did you ever even find out about this game this is the game that when i was taking sleeping medication that did not actually knock me out um it just made me have long amnesic periods <laughs> where I just would do crazy things and then not remember any of them. Um, this game was one of those things. I apparently just, like, was online, not able to remember anything. Oh, Sterling wrote about it? Really? Okay, that's cool. Oh. I'll have to look at that. It is, in fact, the worst-selling Wii title ever, which is, like, that's that's a fucking hard contest, actually. <laughs> that's what's amazing, because there are so many shitty Wii shovelware games that, that that's a fucking contest, man. I don't know if it was an Uwe Bowl, like, tax scam level of game dev or like what happened exactly but <laughs> I got nothing <laughs> I, I doubt it I doubt it I think it was just a shovelware developer made a like, shovelware game and it's I'll post bad. a link to their uh, to their company page on Wikipedia is it like notice um... how you've probably never heard of most of those games Oh, it's Joe Rodan. Okay, yeah, like them and uh, the other one. The uh, I can't remember the name of them. They were like the they make a bunch of like really cheap games that sell for like between like five and twenty dollars on launch. Like that's their company's gimmick. Like I think they were the original people who did the whole like bikini zombie slayer, like Onichibara or whatever it is. Hmm. Onichibara, whatever. Yeah. And, yeah, they they make a lot of really bad games <laughs> as well. And I think it's, like, a similar idea. D4, thank you. <laughs> I want to say, didn't they do the EDF games as well? They did. I think they might have, like, picked up and gotten some decent titles. Even though I've heard the EDF games aren't actually good. They're... You, you have to really like that style of game. But, like, they do what they do really well, I think. Mm. I know Low Tax likes it a whole lot. <laughs> that's mm. that's the only person I've heard who's like the game fucking owns. Wasn't it like a 360 title? They did one for the 360. Um, they actually did another one for 360 that later got ported, mm. and then they did. There were a bunch that only came out in Japan, and then they have one that came out recently that was apparently pretty good. Mm. I mean, if you're an EDF fan. Yeah. Oh, D3 is the publisher, not D4. Okay. Uh, okay. And apparently they, in fact, did not... They had no involvement with Super EDF. Or the original <laughs> EDF for arcades. Uh, which were the shmups with amazing soundtracks that were otherwise... Like, Pretty okay, Schmups, for the time.
They published the Adventure Time games? Really? Publishers are weird. Oh, wait, shit. Um... Wait, is this just... Wait, is... What? <laughs> One second. You gotta find the cat. Oh, you have to find the one that's actually moving. <laughs> what are these fucking shadow clone no jutsu ass cats doing? Like, what the fuck is this bullshit? What? Andy, where's the cat? I have pushed over every fake cat. There's one on the left side on oh the my God. cat box thing. You little shit. It's the only one you didn't hit. Yeah. I sniped every fake cat. Let him know I mean business. <laughs> Seems like it might have been... A weird cash-in on a real-life cat blog that surged in popularity? Hmm. Oh. Seems like an odd cash to go for. Hmm. And actually, I seem to be having some connection issues, so I real quickly am gonna, like, reset my modem and everything. And yep. See if that fixes it, because I had some yesterday, too, so I'm gonna do that real quick. Um, I'll be back in like just a couple minutes here.